Hey guys. Here's the fridge behind me. And my mug cake. How are you guys doing? It's me, Kiger, and right now my parents are out of the house seeing my sister for her birthday um, in Charlotte. Um, I often decide not to go actually last night so I can be as loud as I want. And there's talks. Originally, this video shot with me and Nathan back on September 25th. It's uh, October now, and my sister's birthday is on October the 5th of this year. She's turning 20. Uh, we were originally going to take Tux for a walk. Yes, he's so excited about it, um, just hearing that word. But he has a he had a heartworm problem. Like I, I literally biked around the whole school campus, which is where we eventually walked, but plans kind of changed when we weren't able to go too far. So Anderson Elementary, uh, Murray Middle School, and Ashley High School, uh, I planned that whole entire area. Like, okay, Nathan's going to hold the water bottles. I'm going to walk Tux, and we're both going to alternate the camera. But Tux... Uh, Unfortunately, he has heartworm now, and he can't have that much, like, activity, so instead, that was very unfortunate. I was just like, okay, well, we can't have Tux for a walk, and, but we still went up all this way and everything, so I figured I'll take Nathan for a walk. <laughs> uh, why not? So, anyway, also, this is my Lego Technic crap I'm working on. Come on now, put it on now. I got that one. And so, this is me taking Nathan for a walk. Just letting you know, plans have changed. Enjoy. Nathan, you wanna go for a walk? You wanna go for a walk? Are you ready? Nope. Let's actually go on the sidewalk real quick. There we go. Um, I don't know why I said, like, when we should wait till mom and dad get back, because, yeah, of course, they're on a bike ride. I don't know what the point of that was. Yeah, the couch isn't gonna, like, just drop dead randomly. Oh no, it wasn't even that. I was just saying I don't want to like leave the house and knowing that it makes no sense though. The house, I think the house can handle itself. Let <laughs> me see the. Well, and yeah, there's not much to worry about the sun as it's gonna set soon. We're both a little burnt, maybe more than a little, but it's peaceful for now. And cross right here. I'm already working up a thirst actually. That is the mailbox where we get our mail because we don't have mailboxes. And that is the open house model home. Uh, the right All right, way. let's go. <laughs> oh, no. We made it. No, we're good. Kind of peaceful with those crickets in the background. If you didn't know, actually, Nathan, I bike to school every morning or most mornings. Oh. This is where I bike on this little route, and then I go to school. There's also barely any cars on the road. For a Saturday, like seven o'clock at Saturday night, this is very peaceful. We're also really close to the road. These rocks right here, I wanna see. Is Toadie totally okay too? <laughs> no, these up here. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I know, but I just wanna walk on them. It's, it's kind of fun too. No, okay. I haven't actually really walked on it either. I've gotten like three or four steps in. So how was your sleepover so far? So right up there is tennis courts and I think we might just like chill there and then come back. So this, this is the elementary school, Anderson Elementary, playground, mm -hmm. uh, parking lot. That's really the only thing you're going to be able to see on this little route. The other two are like on that side, which we're probably not going to be going to. We might go to tennis court, loop around a little bit sooner than that. So you can just put water on your feet. This is a sample video. Have I ran out of storage? I guess not. Okay. Yes, we're probably heading back soon. These are the tennis courts. We might take a break and just drink some water. And yes, I talked to the cars. But yeah, tennis courts, high school trail is like right down there. We could have walked it, but the sun's kind of getting to us, even though it's getting darker. So, originally I planned to take you to that store. That one, the only, the only one you can see right now. Well, also that one over there, but. Oh, I guess we see that one in particular. That one's like the highest. Is it? 
I don't know. I see a street lamp. <laughs> the brightest light right now. All right. Um, I think we timed it just right though. Hand him back. Sorry, my storage has been really yeah. on and off, so I have to offload. That, that little dot in the sky. I don't know, I just want to find space interesting. Astronomy? Or yeah, ast that, astrology. Little dot in our sky is like millions and millions of white years away and you can see it. You ready to hear how long it would take you to yeah. drive to walk to your address? Yep. Looked it up on maps. Two days and two hours. That's like the dis that's like the time it takes to drive from no North Carolina to Texas. Well, that's one thing you learn. Is this an ad and it has like a phone number on it? Or something. No, it's like an initial. Oh. Well, why is it played twice? I do not know. Maybe this is like, maybe it's Andrew Destiny or something. Once, also, like just a little bit past that way, like near the trail, but a little bit further, like I was showing you near the tennis courts, I was just walking. Some guy was carrying his frisbee, and I was like, all right, I was actually biking. And he walks past me, I look behind him, and he decides to take the entire frisbee and launch it into the field next to him. Like there was a base, no, there was a football practice field and a baseball field, oh. and he just decided, yeah, let's do. Like didn't test it out, just like throw it up in the air, ten feet, catch it. No, he's like, yeah, boom. A strange light in the room. Oh, right there. Yeah, there's a white light in the room. Yeah, I think that's. I don't know. I think that's a reflection. Place your bet real quick. Do you think mom and dad are back home by now? By the time we're gonna walk home? Well, you have a cheat sheet it's in your pocket or it's in your hand right now. Well, yeah, I could look. I'm not gonna look at their location. We are um, very rather close to house. You think so? By now, I'd say they have to be. Okay. <sighs> what do you think the sign says? It probably says something like, no U-turns. Okay, you know what? It's white, so it's a regulatory sign. Need me to what do you think? I'll tell you, no, it, so it's- I think it's an informational sign. I will tell you, it's not like road sign. Oh, no. I'm road pretty road. sure it's some sort of event for like yeah, the I elementary know. school. No, Evan. Also, Nathan's extremely baffled how large even the elementary school is. I've never is. seen like a public elementary school, right? I didn't know that they crammed like a thousand two hundred kids in them. <laughs> That's actually an accurate number. I'm not lying. Okay, <laughs> my little. School, my school literally put like. Little League, ages five, oh. 16. Look mm -hmm. at that sunset down there. Wow. My school put like at most That's 400 nice kids in the. What are you doing? Why are you. I'm watering the sign. What? <laughs> There's cars around. Are they thinking what do you think they're gonna think? Oh, he's pouring water on a sign. That's vandalism. Maybe. So it's, it rains and that sign's still standing, right? Good point. I want to get mad if I, if I, if you pour like, if you spray paint someone's shirt as opposed to if you pour water on them, they're still not gonna be happy to pour water on them. But are they gonna call the cops? Probably not. You're right. Still, it's unnecessary. I know. You seem quite. Cool. I was gonna say you seem quiet, but you're getting more. You talkative you almost, now. You always wanted to say you're being quite wasteful. People now can use that. <laughs> no. no the ground can use it. Also, uh, we have the NHC 8 p.m. update in the next 30 minutes, I think. Where did you say you wanted to travel to again? Uh, Norway. Norway. That's, right. That's just northern up there. It's way north. Well, way not north. way, way north, like Greenland. But Greenland, I want to live somewhere that actually, like, lots of people in Norway actually speak English. I didn't know that. Isn't there a language called Norwegian? Yeah, there's a Norwegian language, of course. But I just didn't know there was a lot of people who spoke English in Norway. I'm sure. Yeah, my people there's not many more trees cool. that we have to walk under. A lot of uh, European countries nowadays are forcing English as another language you have to take at a young age. So uh -huh. There's a white band flying into the neighborhood. Oh boy. <laughs> Thank you, folks, we didn't see us. <laughs> if it did, we'd Hello? just run into one of these homes. Yeah. Nope. I like these. We don't have to worry about many more trees and also, uh, yeah. One more thing where we were walking is around the spot where I also do cross country practice. Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays will are our meets. And yes, once again, talking to cars. You want to check out one or two of the houses under construction, or nah? Yeah. I doubt we'd see much with this light. That's true. The thing is, there's like not really many construction workers around, but yeah, I can barely even see anything except for the cool spot. Look at this. Oh, look at my camera real quick. You see or, it? Yeah. It's kind of.
Look at this RV, they're remodeling that. Hey, how are you? Have you ever been in an RV, Nathan? You don't think so? Well, thank you for going on this little walk with me, Nathan. Yep. I feel like I took you for a walk. Originally, in my mind, I always like, it was actually, I was on a bike ride and I was just thinking, man, I'm just gonna take Nathan for a little tour around this place. If we can just at least get into like the little waters and the tennis courts, which I did, probably went a lot differently in my mind. But the thing is, it came to reality in some source. So we were arriving back home. You may not even be able to see it. It's kind of getting rather dark, which is about the perfect time. If you don't know, we also came back from the beach. We've had a lot of activity today. We did that beach thing. That was very fun, Nathan. Yep. And other things along with this walk now. Um, well, the garage door was open when yeah, we first came. Back. I think they're back unless the house couldn't handle itself. <laughs> <laughs> open the car? Yeah, this this would be the way to get in the garage door. Um, I'm holding my phone in my bottle. Can you click this button right here? There's like a button I think on the garage or the. Hold on. No, where is it? It's at the top. At the what? You may have taken it inside. Great. Uh, hello. He's in the garage right now. Oh, the garage doors are out, or the garage lights are on. We're actually probably really scared right now. Nathan, bang on the garage, or knock on the garage real quick. Just let them know you're here. Hello? Oh, I hear him. Yes, ma'am? Yes. I'm glad we took that walk. You got at least somewhat of an idea of like the, what was the frog? Kill it. No. You got some idea or image of my school and its root around mm -hmm. it, don't you? Especially with that little body of water. I was gonna see if we could just like chill around on the rocks, but that's a little unsafe. There's a lot of like risky people my age are just like, hey yo man, let's go. Oh, it's just chilling. <laughs> yeah, let's like just kinda shake the whole mat. Please don't gonna jump at you. Okay. He just doesn't care. He's stone cold. Oh, there there he goes. Hi, buddy. Hey, so, buddy. Don't go in the house, please. Nathan's leaving tomorrow, and I'm glad we got to do <laughs> Yeah, if he goes in the house. <laughs> There's a frog right there. You saw, you saw a plane? 